today I'm going to talk about the monitoring and protecting of our environment. So, the grand challenge. Why is this important? Why is the environment important? Well, everybody sitting in this room is directly affected by the environment. Why? Let's take August of this year, for example. Those people living in North Dublin suffered uh, a water alert due to contaminated water. Clean drinking water is a basic human right. There is a grand challenge there for scientists to develop a method to sample and monitor our waters on a regular basis, more so than is currently done. What is our solution to this grand challenge? Environmental sensors that will do this work for us on an ongoing basis. This is very important to our politicians and our stakeholders to make the well-informed decisions on the protection and management of our environment. This is driven hugely by the European legislation that laid down the rules and regulations for the monitoring of our waters. Currently in 2012, Ireland already owes €4 million Euro to the European Commission. So how did we do this? What does this involve? Well, currently monitoring happens in Ireland by putting on those wellies, trudging out onto that field, grabbing those samples, bringing them back to the lab. Or you can pay €25,000 for a fancy sensor to do this for you. However, this means that our rivers and lakes are just not monitored as much as we want them to. However, our solution to this is the technology that we've made in Clarity, which uses a cheaper sensor using chemistry. So what happens? Our sensor draws up a tiny bit of this polluted water. It, acts with, it reacts with a chemical within that sensor. If a pollutant is present, a colour is formed. That colour is dependent on the type of pollutant. So for instance, you see yellow up there, that's for phosphate. The pink, that's for nitrate. The darker the colour is, the dirtier the water is. So what we do is we shine a light through this, and this light measures how intense that colour is. So basically, how dirty that water is. Our smart sensor and technology sends these results to us wirelessly. So what have we achieved already? Well, we've already brought down the cost of commercially available sensors from 25,000 euro to 200 euro. And that's our current phosphate sensor there. However, I want to bring this down to 20 euro through the use of our smart technology and chemistry. So what have I achieved? We only have one sensor that looks at one pollutant. However, after this, we will have a much smaller sensor for 20 euro that will now look at four different pollutants. So it's cheaper, smaller, more reliable, no chemical, very little chemicals and very little waste. And the main thing is, is I don't have to put on my wellies anymore in the middle of January, in the snow and the rain. I can now sit at the comfort of my own desk and you can see me there with my nice little latte and I'm getting these results from, the results there are from a river in Monaghan and I get these daily. So I now get to sit at the comfort of my desk but still protecting our environment and minus the wellies and making sure that your drinking water is nice and clean. Thank you very much.